In this video, we're going to look at how to find the area of a rectangle. The area of a rectangle is given by the formula length times width. So here we've got a rectangle. This is the length, the longer side. This is the width, the shorter one. And then to find the area, you just multiply them together. So let's have a look at a typical uh, question. Here we have got a rectangle. The width is 3 and the length is 9. So to calculate the area, area is equal to length times width. So the area would be equal to the length, 9, times the width, 3. And 9 times 3 is equal to 27. And let's just make sure we've got the right units. Because it's an area, the units would be centimetres squared. So the area of this rectangle would be 27 centimetres squared. Let's have a look at another question. Here we've got a rectangle this time, but this time we've been given the area. The area of this rectangle is equal to 28 centimetres squared. And we know the width is equal to 4, and we've been asked to find why the length of it. Now, those of you that are really good at mental maths might be able to really quickly work out what y would be, because the area, 28, is equal to this y times 4. Well, 7 times 4 is equal to 28, so that means that this length would be equal to 7. And some of you may be able to work that out really, really quickly, so well done. So the area is equal to length times width. So the area is 28, and that's equal to the length, y, times 4. And then you just do 28 divided by 4, so 28 divided by 4 would be equal to 7. So the uh, length here, this y, would be equal to 7 centimetres. Because it's the length of it, it's then centimetres. And that's it. So to find the area of a rectangle, you just do length times width, and just make sure you get the right units, which might be centimetre squared, metre squared, millimetre squared. And sometimes you might be given the area of a rectangle, and if you're given one of the sides, then you would just divide to find then the, the missing side that you're asked to work out. That's it, so that's how you find the area of a rectangle.